When I first arrived at the hospital, I was received immediately and quickly brought to um, a private room where my pain was immediately assessed along with um, what might be wrong with me, um, the overall situation that was going on with me. Um, I felt extremely fortunate to um, not be grilled immediately with insurance information. I had given that information to my dad in the car on the way there and um, graciously they, they let him handle it um, until my situation was completely assessed and my pain was managed. The level of care from the staff was far superior to anything that I had expected or imagined. Um, their level of care was more of inquiring about my well-being overall, not just what they're trained to ask or offer um, in their room visits. Um, yes, they did ask me what my pain level was, but they also were interested in where was I at? How was I mentally? How was I emotionally? How was I sleeping? How was I resting? It was the whole overall experience. Um, the the environment, um, who was coming in and out of my room, the times that they were coming in and out of my room, not only to me, but that it extended into um, who was visiting me at the time. So their level of care even extended into my son, um, my parents, my family, people who were visiting in my room. I always felt heard and I always felt comfortable enough to present any questions or concerns that I had. Um, there was one particular night where I knew that I probably didn't want a specific nurse back and um, so I did request that another alternative be put in her place um, and I did learn that um, another nurse that I'd really liked was working that night however she was in a different station so I don't know what they did um, behind the scenes with scheduling but they did arrange for um, the switch out to take place so that this particular nurse could be my nurse that night. I think most people would say that the nighttime part of the stay in a hospital is not the easiest time or the best time. In fact, most people kind of joke around about how you don't sleep at night in a hospital. And I have to say that most of the nights that I was here, I did have a good night's sleep, um, mainly because of the partnership I had with Judy, who was my night nurse. Not only is it just the, the, the fresh environment, the peaceful surroundings, um, just the overall decor, the private rooms, um, just how everything is set up so that you're assured of having that peaceful environment in your room, but it's the staff. Um, I made friends with some of my nurses. There was one nursing assistant in particular. Her name was Emily. I wanted to take her home with me. <laughs> um, she was fabulous. I know that she was outside of her shift when I checked out of the hospital and she went the extra mile to be um, the person to just discharge me when it was time to go home. Um, there were many people here who I felt like I was leaving my friends and I wanted to come back and stay in touch with them and I'm just very grateful for the experience that they provided me with.